Hello, welcome back to my channel. You join me on another boiling hot day. I literally could not have my hair down because it just looks wet the whole time and it's a bit TMI. I am sorry. Uh, but anyway, today you are joining me and I am actually packing to move to Italy. So I'm going to be packing my um, kind of makeup bag, I'm going to be packing all my skincare, I'm going to be packing my bag which you can see here. Um, it may be in a couple of different days, I'm definitely not going to be able to do it all today. I need to iron some of the stuff that I'm packing. And yeah, getting everything ready. I also need to do a like final shop to buy little bits and bobs. So I'm going to take you along with me and yeah, I'm moving to Italy for nine months. So I'm moving from this September, which is next week, God, until June. So it's not just like a pack with me to go on holiday. No, it's pack with me to move. That's why my suitcase, sorry, my suitcase looks like this because I'm moving. Like I need to take it all with me and it just doesn't fit and it's going to be too heavy. And I haven't even got my shoes in there. So I'm also going to be deciding on my shoes. This is all my makeup, well, everything here that I need to pack away as well. So yeah, let's get into it because it's gonna be a long, long one. So I thought I'd show you the current situation. Don't even look over there. That is what I'm gonna be tackling another day. So that will be another part of this video. Yeah, I just can't even start. This is what I'm trying to tackle today, so. This is basically, I had all my makeup in this bag. This was a bag that I got given um, one Christmas and I loved it. But as you can see, it's the dirtiest thing inside and out. It needs a good wash. So I'm gonna wash that today and put in everything that I'm gonna stay, like keep here. Then this, my last birthday, I got this from my friends. So I'm gonna be putting everything that I'm taking, like makeup wise, in here. I also need a little wash, so I'm gonna wash this before I put anything in. This is just from Primark. And then I may be using these three bags as well. Now this one, I'm gonna be using for everything jewelry, um, like all the little things that I need to take. Um, then this one is gonna be like medicine, vitamins, everything like that. And then this big one, I'm just planning to, I don't know really, for now it's got um, a hairbrush, it's got some pads in, it's got like an extra toothbrush and it's got a little bit of a perfume in. Now if you saw my last video you saw that I've just bought another perfume of these and this is halfway so I don't know whether to take this one or the new one which is up there. Um, yeah this is just the femme one from Zara, Let's see. Anyway I need to decide on this and see what else I'm going to put in here. So for now, I've made two piles. This is a pile of stuff that I'm planning to take, and this is a plan, um, stuff that I'm planning to keep here. This deodorant, I don't actually know what to do with because this is actually less than 100 mil, so I could, I think it's, yeah, 75 mil. So I could take this with me, but then I've also got this deodorant, which is like the Roll-On, Roll and it is so good. It's just a, let's see if I can open it. No, oh yeah. Um, it's like a green stick and it's like really good for the environment, it's just organic, it's just really really good. So I think I'll be taking this deodorant because it's the one I use the most. And then stuff that I've got to decide from here for example is like this for example, my concealers. I have three and they're basically all running out. So things that I need to look at now and think, okay, now for this, I could just leave these here and get a new one. Same with my foundations, they're basically all empty. Um, this bronzer that I use every day is also kind of finishing, so I might get another one of them. And then just check that I have enough of everything and also decide, I think I'll probably put my contact lenses in one of these bags. Um, and yeah, again, like the same with my moisturizers. I've got two here from Garnier, but they're both kind of running out. And then decide stuff like this. Now this is my favorite uh, face wash. It's also in my like get, um, my morning routine video. This is the Kylie skin one. Um, but it is so heavy. How much does it weigh? Don't know if it says. There's two, three, six mil in there. So it obviously has to go in their suitcase, which <laughs> I don't know how. But 
yeah i need to decide if it's worth it because it is quite heavy um so i've got to do this today so i'm going to take you with me on my journey of deciding and then i'll probably take you to the shops with me tomorrow or another day and get whatever it is that i need extras of so that is my bags and the brushes done so this is what the brushes are currently looking like this kind of didn't go back to its usual white the pink did come through but it's meant to look like this and it just doesn't but i might just do that one more time this is like powder bronzer brush and it had the most crap in <laughs> so these are here they're gonna dry off and i put my beauty blender in to soak these were already clean so i've just taken them out of this cup and they're just soaking and then the bags are here now this one was just gross so i'm just gonna leave it out to dry i might just even put it in the washing machine but this is mostly cleaned out so i'm just gonna let them dry and then i'll pack my stuff okay, so while i'm waiting for the bags to dry i thought i would go through everything here decide what is staying and what is going how it's looking this obviously these stuff are going in the bin that's going to be going back into um the pink bag it's so hot right now this is all going to go well these are going to be replaced and these are going to be going into the um gray like the flowery bag and it's just these i don't know what to put into here i'm gonna to have to take them out of the boxes this also needs to be replaced Okay, I'm back and this is now dry. So I was just thinking that I don't know how to do my liquids. So I've got a plastic bag here, which is where I'm gonna have to put my 100ml liquids. Um, so yeah, I'm, I think I'm gonna pack this now with the liquids. How does this open? And then everything else goes in here. Quick update, <laughs> mascara and lipstick has to go in here as well. So, this is all my liquid and this is going to go in the other pink bag because that's staying here and i've got some hand sanitizer that i'm going to just use here this one i'm going to be using now as well i'm going to get some new one and this is looking pretty empty now which is why i'm thinking these bags should go in here as well i'm just still shocked at the fact that there's not a big difference between the rimmel um okay it's very dirty i'm sorry about that the rimmel and the urban decay like uh, setters and there's 30 mil in this one and 100 mil in that one like what the hell okay decision made little one is gonna go in here this one because it's medicine and stuff is just gonna go in the bag whichever bag i can this one is gonna be emptied into here This is a new brow uh, bronzer, I can't even speak. And I've got a new foundation that didn't actually have my color in the, uh, concealer and I'm a bit annoyed at myself because I'm going to journey later on so I could have got it. But anyway, I just got one up, so foundation, concealer. Then I got a massive shampoo, which will hopefully last. And then um, I just bought a mini like travel size conditioner, which I'm just gonna uh, find a conditioner when I'm there. I bought some new hand sanitizer, which is gonna go in my handbag, a little micellar water makeup remover, and then I've got some wipes. Um, this is for like face and eyes, and then just like intimate wipes. So somehow, <laughs> it's 
gonna fit in there. I think I'm gonna do this tomorrow, so I'll see you tomorrow. It is now time to tackle the bags. Now, <laughs> this is meant to be a 20 kilo bag and I weighed it the other day and this has got to go in and there's no shoes in there. And it's, uh, yeah, it weighed 21 kilos the other day without shoes, without anything basically. <laughs> So I need to try, get everything out, I'm going to put them all into piles like t-shirts, jeans, blah blah, decide what I need and what I don't need, then I'm going to put the shoes in first, then I'm going to iron the clothes, put them back in, try to fold them a bit better, better so, so like more stuff fits, wish me luck. <laughs> just really heavy so we have pajamas which I think is okay scarves which I might take one out um, like fluffy socks and slippers that I might just get one pair of fluffy socks one pair of fluffy slippers shorts which I think thought I had more of but I don't jeans you know these I live in jeans I might be able to get one or two pairs out but I just live in them then skirts there's hardly any again might just take one out um, these are dresses, which I don't think I can take any out. T-shirts, maybe a couple. Oh, that's a skirt. Um, this is just like random, like comfy clothes that I want to take. My jumpers, which I mean, again, I'm going to live in my jumper, so I don't think I can take any of them out. Now, here is a bunch of gym stuff. We've got like swimming costumes for when I go swimming. So I might, I think I have three or four, so I'm just going to take two. Then I'm going to take away some of the leggings. Bras, I made to pick a couple away, and jackets. currently looking like um, I tried to put everything in that big blue bag and the big blue bag on its own weighed five kilos so anything that I put in was just making it overweight already so I've got this and for now we've got 15 kilos in and to be honest it is up to the top but I need to fit in some liquids and try to just slot in um, stuff here and there so let's do that is when the problem comes like this little one has literally got a pair of jeans a pair, oops a pair of shoes a scarf and that and it's basically four and on top of this i need to get my laptop in and this pile of um shirts and jumpers and then also i've got all my underwear that somehow doesn't fit anywhere so big bag is basically packed I need to um, iron some t-shirts and try to just fit them on here and then I probably need to sit on it to close it and my little bag is also done but it needs to get my laptop in which I'm obviously not going to put into like the last day and then like pile on top whatever I can and close it and this is the bag that I'm taking it's from Bradford which is like a Spanish um, shop and I mean this front zip is broken but I don't really need anything important in there so 
so this is the bag it opens up like this and here it's kind of got loads of different compartments it's also got like a longer strap which i'll probably need so this one compartment needs to be shut i think yeah like that and then it's got a sock in oh that's not a sock it's one of them scrunchies i don't know why that's in there to be honest i thought there's going to be more crap in here but there's not so what i need to put in here for now i know you can't see me but i just want you to show to see this passport which is here this is a one of my laptop chargers which i think i might actually just put in my handbag i've got a couple of things for my camera um this is just a little purse and mirror which i thought was cute to take with me hand sanitizer extra phone charger i also need to put my phone my charger and my ipad in here a, I probably actually won't put this in, I'll just change the glass on my phone before. And we need some headphones. Then I've got this which I was going to put in, like it's got plastic in, I need to put some like, paracetamol and stuff. I don't know where it's actually going to go, it might go here, it might go in a little one. And this massive bag of liquid. So, oh shit, is that broken? No. Yeah. other jacket will fit in because I've got two more jackets that I need to somehow fit in and then the last thing to do will be put my laptop in I probably won't film that because that's the thing before and I want to upload this on Sunday which is now Wednesday so I'll film uh, ironing and hopefully closing this bag and then I'll be done and then I will hopefully be uploading a vlog soon which is a moving day and you'll see everything that I'll be taking. So let's finish this and uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. Soon there's going to be a lot of Italy vlogs, a lot of traveling vlogs and also I'm going to be starting the teaching um, videos, fingers crossed. So yeah, please subscribe if you haven't already and tap the bell button if you want to be notified about my new videos like this uh, video. Please, it really, really helps and motivates me and I'll see you very, very soon.